Here's sure. Spanish industrial production. It's grim. Here's the Lehman Low, the crisis in 09. Over we go, grim. This is Germany moments ago, literally three minutes ago, year over year, they go to negative industrial production. It's better than Spain, but this is an example of the two Europes that the ECB has to confront this morning. And so the question is, what is the ECB going to do? I find it interesting in watching the crisis that there's the central bank and there's the politicians. And it's clearly up to the politicians yeah. right now. But the ECB is getting mounting pressure. Yeah, I like move. what Kit Juke says, fade the rally, ripping up the European rule book. Uh, is one idea. Dennis Gartman says it's a corrective rather than a material shift. But what I like best, Sarah, it's a new phrase. We need more jargon. We've got EFSM, ESM, FROB. Alphabet C. Add to it PCL. <laughs> PCL. Uh, this a, is the word a, of the day. A precautionary credit line. This has Sounds to do like Spain. what you give a freshman in college. A precautionary credit <laughs> line for Spain. I have no idea what that is. And more importantly, I don't think Mario Draghi knows what that is. Well, it is. comes from a report in a German newspaper about how Spain could use the European bailout fund to try to precautionary take steps to solve its banking crisis. Yeah, but I, again, as Ackerman, you mentioned Ackerman in your opening uh, uh, line there, uh, the statements he made yesterday where he said the ECB has just had too much. It's just too much for them to do. So I, I would look for really a disappointment this morning, nothing dramatic. I'd look for a press conference that gets through the press conference, and then we move on, and as Kit Jukes at Sokgen uh, says, uh, maybe some disappointment in the market. Where are futures right now? Futures are up 11. That certainly shows the enthusiasm. Enthusiasm, right perhaps from the Fed and the European Central Bank, both in the research notes right. this morning. David Zervo says that you should be watching S&P and dollar index yeah. to see if the Fed is going to make but a move. Here, here at 6 a.m., German industrial production negative I know, year that's over year. Your attention. That's a big deal. That's a so really what can they do deal. about it is the bottom line. Well, what they can do about it is move forward. Uh, everybody's searching for a paid European plan, but I haven't seen a single really indication of that. Uh, the German election is, what, 11 days away? German German election? Excuse me, Greek the Greece election. election. Greece June election 17th. is 11 days away. June 17th. That's a long way away. And before away. that, we're getting some French legislative elections. And before that, June 11th, big date, yeah. you're looking at PCL. That's the Spanish banking stress test. But but all in all, I would say it's an, it's an ECB meeting like the last one where their goal will be to get through it without making a lot of news.